targets have differing production point types. So what does this mean? We have a lot of messages in this category, in this project. Let's click on one of them and let's see now over here what's the problem. This is the message 005013 and so the targets. This is one connection and this is the second one. Double click. So let's see in this case for this particular connection. This is a connection between these two and this connection has differing connection point type. So let's see, let's go to the first element. So the second connection point is connected to our device below. Let's go now to symbol function data and then logic. And we're gonna say for this particular device that both of these connection points, this is a junction box in this case, so we're gonna say for both of them that they are conductor wire connection. Although ePlan now sets this yellow background, we're gonna still say OK, apply and OK. And let's see for this one. So this one has only one connection point. And logic for this one is we already have the conductor wire so this is the connection point type so both of these connecting elements that have a connection in between should have the same connection point type we could also set these to various other so for example uh, to direct connection point of course it makes sense to set it to conductor wire because this is in reality a conductor of a cable. So conductor wire in this case, okay. And in this case, now we set it at the connection point two. Let's now select this message and see when we check only completed messages, whether we have solved this message. Seems like we did. So let's go to the bottom. And this message disappeared completely from the list. Let's now do one more example. Take the first one and see. So we have a connection between a terminal and this device connection point of this element over here. So let's compare the connection point types and the properties of the two elements. For the first one, the connection point two should be set to conductor wire, so this is okay. And we have to make sure that also this connection point one is set to conductor wire, which it isn't. Let's set it to conductor wire and OK. OK, one more time. Let's now check this message and check only completed messages. And seems like this was the solution to our problem, also in this example. As I said, it doesn't matter which connection point type, of course you would set it to uh, one that makes sense in reality, in most cases conductor or wire. But the most important thing is that the both connection at both ends have the same connection point type to solve this particular message. And that's it.